Hello, Frankfurt Book Fair attendees. I'm Grant Faulkner, fiction writer, occasional tap dancer, and executive director of National Novel Writing Month, also known as NaNoWriMo. So what's NaNoWriMo? NaNoWriMo happens every November, and it's the largest writing event in the world. Uh, the challenge is simple. Write 50,000 words in 30 days. So that's, that's pretty easy, right? Just 1,700 words a day, every day, for 30 days. So we believe that everyone has a story to tell and that everyone's story matters. And we see, we see proof of that every year. This year, we're expecting nearly 500,000 people, including 100,000 kids and teens, to sign up for the audacious task of writing a novel in a month and having fun doing it, I should add. So sometimes I'm asked, why is that important? Why do we need more novels in this world? Um, my answer is simple. Humans are story-making creatures. That's how our brains are wired. That's how we make meaning in the world. In fact, stories shape our worldview more than facts, in my view. So I think of everything as a story, whether it's a vampire tale or the theory of relativity. And, you know, beyond that, we're living in the golden age of writing because, because every Facebook post, every tweet, every blog post, these are all stories. So more people are writing stories than ever. So that's good. But Unfortunately, life tends to devalue creativity, especially adult life, in fact. Uh, creative endeavors fall lower and lower on people's to-do lists. Maybe they fall entirely off of the list so that creativity is not really a part or a significant part of people's lives. Um, I think as adults, we start to fear things. We fear of being judged. We fear getting started. We fear the unknown. And we just get too busy. So people say, I want to write a novel someday, but we want to help them write that novel today. So... NaNoWriMo gives people the, ability, the, the, the opportunity to make creativity a priority and get, get messy, dive into the mess of creation, to write with abandon, and have fun with others doing it. So beyond that, though, I, th I think like sometimes people, uh, they think of inspiration as something that happens to them. Uh, so they're, they're kind of looking up into the sky and waiting for that lightning bolt of inspiration to strike. But that's not the way inspiration happens. Inspiration happens by sitting down every day to write. And you find inspiration in the act of doing it. So NaNoWriMo also helps creating, create that uh, discipline, that sense, that sense of creative momentum. So this year's theme at Story Drive is Heroes, which is one of my favorite, favorite themes. And as you might guess, who are my heroes? My heroes are those people who, who really embrace creativity and bravely write their stories. And my, my emphasis is on their stories. I think too often people are looking, how do I, they're asking themselves, how do I get published? What magic potion can I drink? What, what, you know, what tips do I need? But the tips are all within you. You have a story within you, and it's, it's, it's your challenge to write it. Um, and I believe that creators, storytellers, make the world a better place in the end. That's why they're my heroes. Um, I think to write a good story, you have to be vulnerable. You have to open yourself up to vulnerability. And, and that's important because vulnerability connects us with others. So I'm looking forward to seeing you at Story Drive because I want to explore the power of storytelling in all different ways. Uh, and I want to do that with you. I want to hear your stories in short. Um, so I look forward to seeing you at the Frankfurt Book Fair. And I, when I see you, I will explain why I'm wearing this Viking helmet. Thanks a lot.